sun, moon, and stars into it. Greetings, signs, and moons. And of course, I have to welcome back all my stars. If you're new to the channel, welcome to the mothership. I do appreciate all of you for your likes, your donations, your shares, the confirmations you send me through email, the positive energy you show me, the positive energy you show yourself, and overall, the positive way you show up on the planet. Now, with that being said, let's get in there like swimwear. Any and all information that you need about me or regarding this reading shall be in the description box below, including all the links if you want to join the membership. Oh, this is beautiful. Okay, a link where you could copy and paste that into your browser and receive a free birth chart from a reputable site. A lot of major arcanas, all right? If you happen to miss the link or you can't find the join or whatever, uh, check the community board, all right? So, I heard disgruntled employee co-worker or something like that for those of you that are employed for others of you this could be happening in your environment you may be picking up on the energy of aggression uh when i look down i seen tantrum we have the three of pentacles in reverse the unalive card in reverse as well as the six of pentacles so we're talking about lack of give and take okay somebody lacks practicality all right. This person is very fearful, fearful that the tables are being balanced here. Some people may be making a lot of suggestions, but it's coming from a place of broken heartedness or bitterness or even a sense of entitlement is also what I'm getting. Why is the three of pentacles here in reverse? I'm hearing everything isn't for everybody. All right. OK, so we got the hangman and the high priestess. So somebody is stuck. They feel like whoever this is in this high priestess energy is the cause of it. But if this is you, you have your back turned towards this. You may also be in this high priestess energy because you are being called to sit down and develop some sort of gift. OK, some of you, you're being called to be quiet. All these cards coming out in reverse. If my child comes in the room, I'm going to have to oh, I'm going to have to pause the video. So. We have the three of swords in reverse as well as the seven of cups in reverse. So somebody's coming out of uh, healing, okay? Coming out of a healing or feeling stuck. Somebody could be coming out of an institution or actually coming out of, I heard coming out of jail, but this person could be coming out the hospital or this just person is just coming out of feeling stagnant. Now, for some of you, you've already reached this level where you have in, um, developed your gifts. Some of you, you could be embarking on a new opportunity. However, someone wants to create a, uh, an, an illusion surround or some sort of confusion surround Surrounding ending, all right. Somebody possibly thought that they ended your career, or they, or something like that. They ended your gifts, but we have the eight of uh, the eight of cups here on the fence. So, okay. So, uh, what I'm getting is somebody seeking public approval, or somebody is. If you have a comment section, somebody could be looking through your comment section. OK, that picked that I picked that energy up before of someone going through people's comments to see who disagrees with them and then agreeing with that person. As opposed to just not watching the content, but this is what I'm talking about. It's a sense of entitlement. OK, uh, people like chaos. They like to start stir up confusion. I'm hearing misery loves company. OK, we have the Knight of swords. So somebody came in with a lie and somebody came in with the truth really quickly. So this could easily be a confrontation. OK, over some sort of opportunity having to do with this this public figure. Now, this could also be a new beginning. Someone's belief systems could be changing uh, in the sense that somebody may. I'm hearing practical. Somebody's being called to be practical, but somebody's belief system when it has to do with tradition, may be changing religion, marriage or status is also what I'm getting. OK. Somebody may be returning back to tradition. You could be going up against a lot of people that want to, I guess they are using the excuse that they are 
defending tradition, but what it is is they're creating obstacles. These people like chaos. They like to keep something. Uh, they like to keep confusion going. All right. Somebody can't resist or they can't. They don't know how to control themselves is what I'm picking up intuitively. Now, this could be somebody losing a skill. OK, this could also be somebody recovering from some sort of group activity. I don't know if you were playing a sport or somebody thought something was a game in this in this situation. Somebody also was feeling burnt out or they wanted you to feel burnt out. OK, so you may be resting. I'm hearing something about comment section closing. I don't know if you are a content creator. Maybe you're thinking about closing your comment section or maybe this is surrounding a. Uh, Somebody that already did three of pentacles in reverse. We have the world card on the fence. Okay. So somebody wanted, this could be someone trying to antagonize somebody that's on the platform. This is, this could be like a troll or something like that. This person continuously does this to multiple people. This person also may be having issues working or I'm hearing a flip-flop. So this person may, they can't get their footing. They don't know what it is they're good at. So this would be the energy of someone, okay? Say, for instance, they may have had a tarot channel. The tarot channel didn't pick up, so they started bad-mouthing tarot or something like that. Why is the, the unalive card here? Yeah, somebody just can't find their footing. This is somebody that's very jealous and envious. Okay, we have the nine of baskets. So this is surrounding someone's happiness. Okay, and it's also surrounding a group. Okay, are working together. Some, yeah, somebody may want to work with you. Somebody may, oh yeah, somebody doesn't want a partnership to end. Okay, yeah, somebody doesn't want a partnership to end. This could also be um, a polygamous or polyamorous, some sort of alternative lifestyle. This may be like a swingers activity as well. Why is the three, I mean, the six of pentacles here in reverse? Somebody, they don't feel reassured in a partnership. Somebody may have... Um, Required a lot of attention in this situation. Let me just say that. So there was some sort of judgment call. Yeah, this is definitely speaking about a three-way situation where three people are involved. Okay, somebody doesn't feel happy. Somebody feels like somebody should feel happy if they have two people or something like that. So there's some sort of tower moment. When I looked down at the daughter of, a, daughter of baskets, this gave me the energy of someone that is younger. Um, 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 and very emotional, whether if they are male or female. Why is the Four of Swords here in reverse? These cards are new, so they're going to stick together. So we have the Wheel of Fortune. So this is a faded situation here. I feel like someone didn't learn their lesson or somebody couldn't travel towards you. Maybe they were blocked off from traveling towards you. Okay, this person maybe wanted to work with you or something happened with this person's work. They're in this energy of burnt out, so now they have to rest. Okay, the father of coins is telling me that this person takes care of a lot of people. I'm also hearing multitasking. All right, so this person may be watching you, watching me, watching readings. This could also be a reader. OK, there was some sort of eclipse that happened in this person's life. This could also be someone being injured. Maybe this person had to um, take a rest. OK, somebody's waiting for some sort of results here. OK, we have the seven of wands. That result may cause someone to be defensive or they were in the past here. OK, surrounding a home environment. Somebody could be a single father. Why is the seven of cups here in reverse? Somebody daydreams a lot. This could also be somebody that's resisting some sort of tempting offer. Possibly somebody that's being tempted by three or more different people. This could be somebody that's married or someone that is celibate, male or female. But this could also be somebody trying to tempt someone into like a three-way as well. Okay, we got temperance in reverse. So somebody's divinity is being tested. Somebody's trying to get balance here. This is somebody that's refusing conflict, but they have this 
very like in your face type of energy. It could be a mother, a child's mother. This person may be upset because maybe this individual left home or they want to leave home with the magician here and the strength card. So it's taking this person everything that they have within them to resist some sort of offer. I feel like they daydream a lot about their true divine partner. The Eight of Cups keeps coming out in this position um, for the last couple of days here. Okay, yeah, this is what I thought. Yeah, we have the mother of, what is this? The mother of knives in reverse. This is somebody that's very smothering, okay? They're very insecure. They could possibly have an addiction. This is someone that doesn't know how to manage money or manage the household. Okay. So somebody's going to receive some sort of clarity about this person. This, this mother of knives in reverse, they may be very critical of whoever this person is. More than likely is somebody that they were in a partnership with, possibly even a marriage with the judgment card being here. This person gained some sort of clarity. OK, I feel like as a, as a last result, they may have um, let someone into their home here, possibly someone younger. And I don't see the Empress card here, but somebody may have conceived a child in this situation. Yeah, we got to look at this mother of wands. OK, yeah. Somebody could have a choice between. And this is weird. This is not going to be for everybody. They have a choice between two different uh, people that they had like a three-way relationship with. Somebody's got cut out or somebody's fearful of getting cut out. Eight of Cups. Ooh. We got the Son of Basket. So, okay. So, what this could be. Is this could be somebody that's overly emotional, like a whine, like whiny is what I'm getting, like bratty if they don't get their way. I'm hearing like mother, like son. I don't know what that means. Mm. We got the nine of coins. Okay, don't get mad at me. I'm just reading the energy. We got the nine of coins here. Somebody uses work as an excuse to not be in this uh, environment. Somebody's fearful of some financial setback. Okay. This person may keep going back and forth because their money is being threatened some way. Yeah, somebody is threatening somebody's finances. This person has a lot of debt. They may be threatening this person to go to court is also what I'm getting with the Knight of Swords. Somebody came in and spoke some truth, but there could have been an argument. There was some sort of confrontation that took place here. Yeah, look at that. So someone in your life is causing conflict. Let's see. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Oh, too many cards. I got to get these cards uh, bent in. You know how you got to break them in? Don't really care for this card stock too, too much, but I like the, the illustrations on the cards. So let's see. The Knight of Swords, why is this here? Oh. So. We have the Hermit card. So somebody went within to reflect or they need to go in and reflect. Surrounding a partnership. Okay. This person, for some of you, this person or you went in and uh, did some inner reflection and you decided to put your defenses up against this person or this is what hap this is what is happening to them. For some of you, somebody may have came in and spoke an untruth surrounding a situation that has, has something to do with you. Okay. And so somebody may have found out that there was a lie. OK, I'm hearing somebody was presented with a lie. So somebody decided that they wanted to be single or they want to be single. If this is like a work environment, somebody doesn't want to work with someone anymore. OK, for some of you that if this is a work environment and you met someone at work, because I've been getting that energy a lot lately, you knew that this person had someone here. So you made a judgment call. OK, I'm hearing out of fear. You may have felt like this person wasn't giving you enough time. I'm hearing everything was okay when um, 
you felt or this person felt the time was being split equally. Somebody decided that they wanted to go home or something like that, maybe because they were being threatened with child support or spouse's support, and it made a third party very upset. So now somebody is in this defense mode with the Seven of Wands, okay? Or at least they feel like they have to defend themselves, possibly even in court. In court. Somebody wants to be single in this situation. I'm here and let go and let God. We got the tower in reverse. So somebody was trying to avoid some sort of tower by coming in and saying something before you said, before you said it or before somebody saw something. The son of wands. So either somebody is immature or somebody just they don't know how to control their energy, control their passion or something like that. Somebody could have got upset and this is giving me like swinger activity. Somebody could have got upset and went after someone's younger sibling or somebody younger that somebody works with. We got the mother of basket. Yeah. Queen of cups. So this is somebody that uses emotion against someone. This is also somebody that use that may use their psychic gifts in a, in a very low vibrational way. And we got the unalive card in reverse. So somebody didn't. We got it here and we got it here. Here and here. So somebody didn't want something to end or something to change. They want somebody to feel stuck or they want to keep this person stuck. All right. Somebody is definitely in this energy of stagnation. Let's see. I'm going to go to the other side for the reverse cards before I do that. The world card, why is this here? Going right over there to the world card. Courage. So somebody needed courage to close a chapter here. Okay. I feel like this person kept themselves stuck in this situation, possibly because they're, this was a work environment. All right. Somebody didn't play fair. Somebody's work is also shady. Somebody's into shady work. They operate with no integrity. Four or five could be significant. Somebody has bad workmanship or they don't work as a team player. This person or you, you needed to use your intuition in the past regarding somebody's skills. Somebody's fearful of going forward because they're fearful of the unknown. Nine of basket. Why is this here? Too many cards. Nine of baskets. Why is this here? Destiny. Okay, so somebody needs to have courage to take a leap of faith. This person doesn't believe in miracles, but this was a destined situation with the nine of cups being here. Somebody could have been greedy or in this energy of just wanting what they want. This could also be somebody that took their power back. They may be used to giving up their energy, their time, their emotions to people around them. This is talking about abundance here. Somebody's having a difficult time with the ending. Somebody lacks confidence here. Somebody's very upset with the frustration being here in reverse. Line of basket. One card, please. Yeah, this is a love situation. Yeah, so this person needed to develop their intuition, use their brain in this scenario here. Okay, somebody was fearful of being judged. Okay, I feel like somebody leaned on someone at work. Is also what I'm getting. Somebody also may have, you know, I don't know if they were trying to sleep their way to the top. Okay. I like to say that this reading is for entertainment purposes only. Any of you that need any type of assistance, I, I suggest that you seek medical professional legal assistance outside of this platform. Okay. Somebody needs how to learn to accept that something is over. Three of baskets. Why is this here? Advanced acceptance, law, and survival. So somebody is in this energy of survival, right? And so this person may feel like they're going to use what they got to get what they want. Now, somebody in this situation did not want a partnership to end. This person needs to get balanced. They also may have some sort of addiction. 
Somebody was refusing some sort of conflict here. This person was causing a lot of illusions or they were under the influence and being under the influence um, allows them to make bad decisions with the temperance card being here. This is talking about disruptive energy. So I feel like some sort of curse or illusion was broken for somebody. Okay, somebody's in this energy of following their bliss. Why is judgment here? Be open. So, oof. so somebody's no longer open to being used. This is a situation where there was no fair exchange and no fair exchange, no robbery. There was no equal intake. Somebody feel like they was given too much in a situation and they don't want anything to do with it, whether if it is work, if it's a relationship. I also feel like, yeah, somebody wants somebody to return. Uh, back to uh, an environment that they're not comfortable in and they're not open to that would be open here on the fence okay on the flip side somebody may be going to a store and they be maybe realizing that the store is not open this could be your favorite store i don't know why that's important okay we got adequacy this is about somebody's work. Somebody lacks self-restraint with stillness. Somebody needs to definitely go into hermit mode or they possibly did. This person may have ghosted a situation that they use for convenience. Father of coins, why is this here? Yeah, I feel like this person is just chilling. <laughs> Okay, uh, are they were in the past? Okay, I hear chill accent. So they completed a cycle. This person may have traveled or they just moved away from this toxic workspace, these toxic people. And now they're just in the energy of, I'm here reaping what they sown. Okay, this person went off and spent some time by themselves. They could have went on a, a mini vacation or possibly even to family. Like a father figure or uncle. This person may live in another part of the world. We got communication, adequacy, and self-restraint. So this person was healing. They may have been on a, a retreat. I feel like this person or you, you're in this energy of appreciating the little things, right? We got light in the dark. So somebody's definitely a guide here. This person may listen to a lot of medita a lot of meditation. They may even do meditation. They're in some form of healing work. Okay. Before I get up out of here, I'm gonna get some closing messages. For those that are interested, we got the high priestess. So somebody's definitely keeping a secret in this situation. Most definitely. It could be a masculine energy. Or there's someone that's like a father figure that's keeping a secret. Or they have a mistress or something like that. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I do feel the energy of someone thinking that they can sleep their way to the top. Why? What's the messages here? Parting messages for anyone that may need them. So bring it to the wisdom of your body. We got the heart guardian. Love and let yourself be loved here. So somebody, you know, I hate to say it, but somebody is in this energy of, of somebody feels. I'm getting worthy, worthy -less, worthiness. They lack worthiness, like self-appreciation. This is someone that sacrifices their body for material material gain. We got surrender to play, take a break from overthinking, a goal, do something fun. Play is a time of recreation and rejuvenation. Take a break from overthinking, a goal, do something fun. Play is a time of recreation and rejuvenation. Interesting. So somebody needs to heal their heart here. Okay, and I do feel like somebody in this energy, it is doing that or they were in the past or they're being guided to all right so somebody has their defenses up against everybody in this situation because they feel like they can't trust them this is somebody that 
is healing their heart. This individual feels like if people really care that they'll let them do them or be them because they're there for a lot of people. And this is somebody that values integrity. There was something that was being done when this person wasn't around or things were being said about this person when they weren't, they weren't around, possibly the co-workers or family members or something like that. OK, this could be a place where there's a family a family business. OK, like or a small town where people know each other. We got surrender to the wisdom of your body. Listen to your body's messages about a person or situation. If you feel physically drained or uncomfortable, be cautious. If you are energized and happy, move forward. Yes, because somebody is dealing with somebody that literally drains their energy. And if it's not in the bedroom, it is with arguments, with fuss, with worry. Somebody doesn't want somebody to achieve a milestone or something like that. They may not want this person to travel. Like this person may feel antsy and agita agitated and fearful because they're around somebody that tries to imprint negative energy on them. And here we have the sage. So somebody is a healer. I don't want to say that this was the last stage of this person's like growth. But they definitely learned something and I believe it has something to do with overworking. We have Lord. Take charge with authority. And we have the sage. Be devoted and committed. This is interesting energy. Somebody may have went to see a guru or some sort of practitioner, possibly in a wooded area, or they went out on a retreat. Okay. Yeah, we got be the light. I mean, this is actually... Yeah, somebody was around. This is definitely an empath, whether if they are male or female. They were around um, very confrontational people. They possibly couldn't distinguish their emotions from other people's emotions. Like this is somebody that's really highly sensitive. OK, but there's a new opportunity coming for those that are open. Some of you, you're still in this energy of um, of healing. This is also like a reminder that, you know. We're never truly alone. So integrity counts. Deuces. Apologies. I just wanted to let everyone know that I will be clarifying the reversals over there on the membership side. So if you're interested, check those out. In the next insert, there will be a clip of all the different tiers that are offered. Make sure to choose the best option for you. See you over there on the membership side.